this is the last video I'm making. After this, they will find a superficial reason to close the rest of my accounts all the rest of the way. Both of them. And it goes like this. I had my followers start one of my accounts because I knew that I can't trust anybody. It goes like this. My parents, the family of Patrice Smith, the school, as well as the Valley Medical Center, because of my videos and because of the wrongdoing they are trying to cover up, they have colluded. They just told exact, my parents exactly how to press my buttons, and they have vandalized my stuff. The circumstances that took me to the hospital last time was me complaining about my mistreatment. Um, to show you what I'm talking about, I live in the middle of nowhere, okay? And here are my receipts, okay? Tell me why I live with a brain surgeon, and time and time again, and they know that I hate going shopping. They know that that's a problem that causes me to get pissed off, and here I am. Shopping, 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 shopping. This is just from the last, just from the last couple months. Okay, why am I going shopping more than anyone else in this house? What, what, what did, I, did I make the choice to move to middle nowhere? Did I disenfranchise everybody with my stupidity, or was it them? Just from the last month, why did, why do I have to go shopping so much? What is the problem around here? It's food. What did I point out to him? before I got sent to the hospital last time. A huge box full of fast food receipts. A huge one. It's the pharmaceutical companies partially to blame. They're the ones who sent consultants and inspectors to see what angle they can assist. So everybody who has a problem with me is assisting the law enforcement agencies, Valley Medical Center, and everyone else. Remember, Patrice Smith, her family works for the school. Her mother is a dispatcher for Santa Cruz Police Department. She's also members of certain different clubs, different groups that tie into the school as well, different feminist movements, different secret societies, if you will. But I wouldn't even use that term because it, it, it implies that I'm making this up. But I'm not making any of it up. You can look it, um, you can look it up. Okay? So we got the judges. We got the neighbors. We got the people at YouTube who I've cussed out as well for, you know, censoring my videos for no reason. Everybody who I've named in these videos have found each other and have collaborated against me because of the vested interest they have in sabotaging my life and discrediting what I have to say. The government wants to discredit what I have to say because they don't want me busting them out. So the psychiatrists and the pharmaceutical companies want to discredit what I say because they don't want people to stop buying their drugs and killing themselves. The eugenicists want to discredit what I say because they want to continue aborting black babies. The school wants to discredit what I say because one of the teachers, which they not only hire but continue to employ and continue to share vested interests in sabotaging my life and my school is part of the white power structure. Ash Wednesday, rise from the ashes. I have now given you the exact list of enemies that I have given all my vengeance groups. This is not a threat. All I have done is told the people who you oppressed, told the people who have to lose their profit because of what you did to him. That's all I have done. I have not instructed them to attack anybody. I disowned the bicycle group when they the bicycling group when they implied that the best way to get revenge was to use bicyclers. I said, no, 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 no. And then in Oakland the other day, a couple of them got in a shootout with each other. And then a church was vandalized. My groups exist, you fools. Read the fucking news. And I didn't order them to hurt anybody. But they know who you are, and when I'm gone, who will stop them?